PE and Health 4, Quarter 3, Week 3. Matatag Curriculum. For the competency, demonstrate healthy and balanced food choices to include essential nutrients. For the objectives, identify the essential nutrients. Discuss the functions of essential nutrients in the body. Content, essential nutrients and their functions. Benefits of a balanced meal and balanced diet in engaging in physical activities. For the integration, we have values, good health and well-being. A balanced diet contributes to overall health and well-being by providing essential nutrients that support physical and mental health. Clean water and sanitation. A balanced diet requires access to clean water for food preparation. Promoting a balanced diet aligns with the goal of ensuring sustainable access to clean water and sanitation. For day one, are these foods healthy? Why? Fill the correct letters to complete the word or words based from the picture presented a while ago. Here are the correct answers. For number one, macronutrients. Number two, micronutrients. Three, carbohydrates. Four, proteins. Five, fats. Six, water. Seven, vitamins. And number eight, minerals. For the lesson purpose, what are healthy foods and essential nutrients? Let's have activity one, healthy foods and nutrients song and dance. Here are the procedures. You will be divided into five groups. I will show examples of healthy foods and the nutrients found in those foods. Your task is to compose a song using the names of the foods and the nutrients as lyrics. Use any Filipino folk song as the tune for your song. Perform your song with a simple dance. Foods and Nutrients for the second set of pictures, proteins. Next, fats. Minerals and vitamins. And water. Let's talk about the essential nutrients and their functions. Macronutrients Carbohydrates provides energy to the body. These are important for muscle contraction during intense exercise. Enables the body to perform vital functions such as maintaining body temperature, keeping the heart beating, 
and digesting food. Next, proteins. These are the building blocks for muscle and other important structures such as the brain, nervous system, blood, skin, and hair. It helps transport oxygen and other important nutrients. In the absence of glucose or carbohydrate, the body can use it as energy. Next, fats. Provides an important source of energy in times of starvation or caloric deprivation. It is also necessary for insulation proper cell function and protection of our vital organs. For micronutrients, we have vitamins. There are two groups of vitamins. First, water-soluble vitamins. These are not stored in the body and so we must get them regularly from our diet. Examples include vitamin C and the B vitamins. Next is fat-soluble vitamins. These can be stored by the body in the liver and fat tissues. Examples include vitamins E and D. Here are the functions and benefits of vitamins. It helps the release energy from the foods that we eat. It acts as antioxidants to protect cells from damage. Next, minerals. It helps build and maintain strong bones and teeth. It helps nerves and muscles to function normally. It helps the blood to clot normally. Water. It helps improve cognitive function. It helps in the food digestion. It helps enhance physical performance. For day two, pick and match procedures. You will be divided into two groups, the macro group and the micronutrients group. In your group, discuss the nutrients specified for your group by answering this question. If you had to improve your diet, to include more of a specific nutrient, example given, protein, vitamins, minerals, what changes would you make? After answering the question, your group will discuss the functions of the nutrients and explain why you need to improve your diet based on those functions. For learners' takeaways, making informed choices. How can understanding essential nutrients help you make better food choices in your daily life? Exactly! Understanding essential nutrients helps you choose foods that support your health and provide the energy your body needs. Consider the last time you bought groceries. How did your knowledge of essential nutrients influence your purchasing decisions? Here is a possible answer. When I bought groceries, my knowledge of essential nutrients helped me pick healthier foods like fruits, vegetables, and protein-rich items. Personal nutrition. Reflect on your daily diet. Are you getting a balanced intake of essential nutrients? Which nutrients are you consuming adequately? And which might you be lacking? 
Think about a recent meal you had. Identify the nutrients present in that meal. How did it contribute to your overall nutritional needs? For your assessment, answer the following questions. Number one, what are the macronutrients and their benefits? Two, what are the micronutrients and their functions? Number three, what are the functions of water in the human body? For day four, write the word true if the statement is correct and false if the statement is incorrect. Number one, sweet potatoes contain carbohydrates. Number two, green leafy vegetables belong to the Go Food group. Number three, nuts are good sources of proteins. Number four, milk helps in the development of bones. Number five, water is only good for food digestion. Here are the correct answers. For number one, true. Two, false. Three, true. Four, true. And number five, true. Directions, match column A with column B. Write the letter of the correct answer.